the Zara box. You're probably totally sick of the set of me and my Zara orders. So I've ordered um, some Zara boots. I've never ordered shoes or boots from Zara before. This box is absolutely massive. Um, but I saw the other day they got some really cool boots and I really wanted to try them. Obviously, if I live near a Zara, I would just nip in and try them. I wouldn't have to order them. Don't know what size I am in Zara, so I'm normally about an eight-ish or seven and a half. So I ordered a size seven and an eight in snakeskin boot. I ordered a size seven in the gold boots because by the time I'd made my mind up that I wanted to order the gold ones, the size eight had all sold out. So they've arrived today with my lovely postman. I really don't even know if I'm gonna like these. I really don't even know why I ordered them. I just had this urge, you know how you do sometimes, to just have something really quirky. So I'm not sure if they're gonna be too high because now I'm getting a bit older. I, I can't walk as well in really high heels. So here they are. So these are the size um, eights. So they're a 41, which I normally am a 41. So. I think I will need an eight, in which case probably the gold ones will be too small for me anyway. So these are the snakeskin ones. The heel's supposed to be just under three inch. So my regular choice shoes are normally about two and a half inch, which is about there. So whether that extra half an inch will make a difference, I'm not sure. They're not heavy, which is good because when they're really heavy, obviously they're a nightmare to walk in. Um, they don't look massively big on the calves which again you never know till you try these boots on i've got quite thin legs and sometimes they look like wellies on me so again we'll see they've come in really nice dust bags which is a really nice little touch for your boots so that's one pair of snake skin here's the other pair of snake skin and then these are the gold ones oh my goodness wow okay Ta -da! look at them just look at them <laughs> I sadly think they're going to be too small though. So I really wish that I could have got the eight and I didn't and it's probably going to bug me forever. These are probably going to be too small and it'll just annoy me forever that I couldn't get the gold ones in an eight. I should have ordered them when I first saw them. So Chanel did some like these a few years ago. Um, the only difference is the Chanel ones had uh, like fancy diamonds and jewels and stuff on the heel. So these are just like mock croc. Aren't they awesome? I love them. Whether I would ever wear them, I have no idea. Where would you wear gold boots? But then you think, who cares sometimes? So anyway, without further ado, kind of reflecting the light. Without further ado, let's just try them on. Let's go. Right, okay. Ta-da! Can't feel my toes. Too small. Literally crying. <laughs> so they are a bit small. Um, I'm not sure if they're a bit high as well, actually, for me. Um they're pull-on I didn't realize they're pull-on boots so I thought they zipped up but they don't so as you can see they are a bit big on my legs but then I think they're supposed to be like that and they're supposed to bend you can see how they're bending a bit they're supposed to be like that apparently um I love them would I ever wear them I have no idea um do I look like I've got gold wellies on yep do I look like I'm going to fancy dress party Yep, <laughs> you're probably all killing yourself laughing. Um, but they're just cool. I love them, but they are. Oh, this left one is just a bit too tight. I, I'm struggling to fill my toes. So I would have liked them in an eight. Um, but then probably it's a blessing that I can't get an eight, maybe. I don't know, but they're just cool, look. They're just, yeah, absolutely brilliant. I love them. <laughs> I'm so sad. If I can get an eight, I will, I think. Um, I'm not sure. Anyway, let's try snakeskin ones on. These boots are made for walking. <laughs> That's just what we all do. Woo! <laughs> so these definitely fit me. Uh, loads more comfy than the gold ones. I've just looked on the internet on Zara and it says the size eight and the gold are coming soon. So they are going to get some more in stock. <gasps> it's very tempting very tempting um what do we think to the snake skin ones ruby said look like i've got wellies on because <laughs> obviously there is a bit of a gap going off around here but i think they're supposed to be like that i think that is the fashion to have them that they look a bit wellified if that makes sense and they do bend which is also i think what they're supposed to do they're supposed to look a bit slouchy down here <sighs> This is going to be a difficult decision. Do I like them or not? I love them. Will I wear them? I don't know. 
Mm, I think they're 70 pounds, so they're not the cheapest boots on the planet, but they're also not the most expensive boots on the planet. Um, I mean, this is the woman that wears pink shoes, so why am I even thinking about getting rid of them when they're so cool? But I'm trying to be practical. Um, yeah, well, anyway, I'm waffling, aren't I? So if you are looking for some quirky boots, Zara, I've definitely got quirky boots this time. So they've obviously got snakeskin ones, gold ones. They do do some real leather gold ones, which I think they're about about 160 pounds they're not cheap at all um but they are real leather obviously these are not real leather whether these will make your legs a bit hot i'm not sure um i'm gonna try them with my jeans as well like skinny jeans see what they look like um yeah so that's my little boot review so i hope this was useful so um if you are unsure of sizing i'd probably go for your regular size so obviously i thought i might get in a seven but i haven't done so an eight is definitely perfect for me um if that helps at all i am five foot six if that helps on the length so they are just up to my knees so they're the perfect sort of height for knee length boots and i'm about a size 12 again if that helps at all and i'm 43 <laughs> i'm clocking on a bit <laughs> anyway my dear so i hope you've enjoyed this little unboxing and this little boot review i hope it's been useful so if you do enjoy shopping zara secondhand shopping and whatever else we get up to then please subscribe to my channel and come and find me on instagram at mrs crazy bag lady i can't wait to see the comment section <laughs> let me know what you think do you love them do you hate them do the gold ones look like wonder woman you know is it ridiculous is it fun is it why not you're only here once moments or not i don't know anyway so many thanks for joining me i'll see you soon bye